come, Tripper. Good. Yes. Come around. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. Come, come. Good, come. Yes, Tripper. Yes, good, come. Good boy. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Oh, almost. Here. Good boy, yes. Yes. You want to go in and get him? It's okay. Look, here. Good boy. Good, good in here. Yes. 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 Here, come. Come. Okay, let's get Daddy in here, too. Let's see what we can do, bud. Oh, big boy. We don't want you on my lap, so let's show you. You can go under the front gunnel, or sorry, under the front fort. Go under, go under. Go get it. Yes, place. Good place, yes. Hold on, hold on. Here, 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 here. Good, Tripper, good, stay. Place, place, place. Good boy, yes. Good boy. We're going to do little tiny training sessions like that. Make sure I put, put him out of the canoe so he knows he can't jump out on his own. Do you want to come in? Get it? Do you want to come in? Get it? These are very healthy, low calorie, soft training treats. Come, come, come. <laughs> Good boy. So I'm just trying to teach him right now that the canoe is okay. Like, he's going to be my canoe partner. Come on. Come on. So he, 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 he needs to learn the canoe. So let's check out a small clip from my buddy Robert Cabral, the dog trainer, telling me exactly how I need to be doing this and the reasons why. Today's Ask Me Anything goes out to Joe Robinette, who um, he and I are doing something kind of special where we're training his dog Tripper to be a great outdoor dog, a camping dog, a wild, uh, not a really wild dog, but a dog that uh, can go out in the wilderness. I guess a wilderness dog, you want to call that. And uh, Joe reached out to me for some tips to, to get some training started. And uh, Chipper is going to be a great dog. I got a good feeling about it. Joe's really dedicated to it. And the first thing is getting Chipper used to being in a canoe. So what you want to do, I know you want to take the dog out in the canoe, but I don't want you to do that just yet. What I want you to do is to make sure there's no failures. Take the canoe, put it on the ground, and, um, and start feeding the dog a bunch of treats to get the dog to climb in and out of the canoe, climb around the canoe. And, um, and make it all a really positive experience. So the more treats you can give him, the more you can get him used to it being unstable, maybe when he's in it, move it a little bit. All those kind of things are gonna be suspicious to the dog, and you don't want him to be suspicious when he's in the water and he flies out of the canoe. So uh, I would start using some treats, lure the dog around the canoe, lure the dog into the canoe, um, have him in the canoe, start moving the canoe a little bit while he's in there, and then, um, and then maybe feed him a couple times in the canoe. Make sure everything positive is happening in the canoe, that he stays in there, that he's eating in there. Um, I wouldn't really play games. I try to keep his drive a little bit lower. He's a duchy, so his, his tendency is gonna be to go really crazy, but you have to go real slow. I wouldn't take it out in the water just yet. I'd probably spend a day or two getting him um, used to it, like I said, on the land, moving it around a little bit, getting him in where you wanna start sitting him in the canoe, because I know you're gonna probably wanna have a special spot for him in there. Um, and just get him used to being in that spot, feeding him, get, have that be his special place, and, um, and, and just make that, that experience super, super positive, um, moving it, and then maybe in a day or two, move it on to, you know, into the water a little bit, let him start to see the imbalance, because the, 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 uh, the stability of the canoe is gonna change. So that's super simple, hope you're having fun, keep me posted, and uh, if you got a question, ask me anything. Let's walk around the canoe again. Good, yes, yes. See if, this might work actually, tipping it on its side and having him go into it. Come, around, come, 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 come. No tripper, around. Good around, good around. Yes, yes. Back, back. So he doesn't know that this thing moves, right? He's not familiar with how unstable it can be, all that stuff. So this is the, the whole point. Good boy. Good boy. Here. 
Yes. Tripper. Yes. Good, good, good. Yes, Tripper. Canoe, canoe. Good, good. So I'm letting him smell it. He's understanding good things happen in this boat, that this isn't something to be scared of, that he's going to be confined in. This is going to be a happy place. Like Robert said, I am going to feed him in here today two times. Tripper, come. Good boy. This might take a few days of this, and then I'll take him out to some open water down the road, and um, we'll put him in and test it out first. Just a little short, short, short uh, training sessions with this. I don't want him to get frustrated. I don't want to get frustrated. This is very important to me. This is extremely important to me. So he's, he's looking to my hand, and this is another thing Robert uh, talks about. You don't you want to confuse the dog where the treat's coming from. You don't want him to always look for it at your hand. It's okay, bud. Here. stuck you can't get them under the, the pedals here buddy good yes here here tripper here yes yes good canoe yes yes good boy good boy yes big boy that's did you guys see that he was in it completely look look he's in it this is a huge thing for me this is a huge step guys I would love to tip the boat right side but I know it'll just scare him Look, trip, trip. Or maybe it won't. I don't know. Here, buddy. Here. There you go. Good boy. Good boy, Tripper. Yes. Here, here. He didn't even notice. He's eating the treats. He didn't even notice. Yes, good tripper. Good tripper. Yes. 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 Place. Good tripper. Good. Hold on. Hold on. Place. Good tripper. Yes. Yes. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. Yes. You're a good dog. You're a good dog, Tripper. You're making me happy, buddy. Oh, man. That's so cool. He should hopefully start to look in there for things now. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Good boy. Here, Tripper, here, here. Canoe. Canoe. Good boy. Good boy, yes. I'm so happy right now. Good canoe. Place, place. <laughs> I'm very happy. Good boy. Yes. I'm sure I did that wrong there where he tried to get out and I took him out and I said, good boy, yes. Uh, I'm sure that that was wrong. Um, but I, I don't really know everything. Every little min finite detail and in, in, in the way to conduct myself while doing this, I'm, I'm, I'm still learning this. Um, I had a good knowledge of scout again it was a different different time so and a different dog <laughs> all right we're gonna try this for the next couple days then we're gonna go to the boat you're a good boy tripper come <laughs> so robert does um this ask me anything uh training series and people comment questions uh, common questions about their dogs and problems they're having and he shoots out these little one minute two minute five minute videos showing sometimes demonstrating how to do certain things and uh yeah he's got his head screwed on he knows what he's doing so i'm i'm keen to listen so definitely go check out robert cabral um I'll, again i'll link it he's got like uh, maybe 40 or 50 thousand subscribers on youtube all right it's uh it's lunchtime we got his food in his little puppy kong normally he eats it in his crate watch he'll think he's gonna go in there let's trick him Cause I don't want him assuming things, right? Yeah. 
She knows I have it. Come. 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 He doesn't like to come down the stairs. I might have to carry him. Come. Good boy. Come on. Come on. Come. Good boy. Come, 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 good boy. Yes, 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 good boy, yes, good dog. That's, that's uh, progress. So he's going to be moving that, that thing's all unstable now. Well, he's moving it back and forth. He's going to get used to it. He's going to feel fine with it because he's eating food. He's not going to care about the boat. He's going to care about the food, right? I got him up in the front there because I want him. That's going to be his place when we're riding together. At least for the first little bit. He'll be up in front of me. That made me very happy when he jumped right in there. That was the first time he did that. You know, you've seen every time I've put him in here once. <laughs> That's great. That's so cool. The, the, the progress is very exciting. It's, um, it makes me feel good. He noticed that. He definitely noticed that. I'm just trying to rock it back and forth a bit. Let him understand that it's not very, the stability changes. It's not gonna always be the same thing. That's how it'll be in water, right? Especially where rough water. Good boy. Look, now he likes the canoe. Good boy. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. Come on, trip. Come on. Come on, trip. Good boy. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. You gonna go poop? You go poop. Oh, do you go to pee? Big pee. Good pee. Yes, good pee. Yes. 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 What a good dog you are, Tripper. What is it? There's nothing there, man. It's the tire. It's a tire. What are you doing? All right. Hey, come. 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 Yes! Yes! Good! Yes, good dog, good tripper. Good boy. Yes, yes, yes. Come here. Tripper boat. Yes, good boat. Here, here. Good. Good, did you get it? Good boat, good, good, good. Tripper boat. Good boy. Yes, good boy, good boy. I've got a Kong in there with his food, a little dollop of peanut butter on top of it. And as you can see, he knows the word boat already. He's jumping in uh, on command. So now, a good idea. I was told, Robert said to shake it, make it unbalanced. He's, he does not care at all. Look at that, I'm rocking it quite a bit. He does not seem to care. He's not paying attention to that at all. He's just eating his food. This is exactly what I want him not to react to anything. Indifferent. Place. I want him up here in the front. 
I have to teach him the place command still. That'll be next. So it's empty now. I'm gonna take it from him. And I'm gonna take him out of the boat like I've been doing. Because I don't want him jumping out on his own yet. After after he's got it all down, that'll be fine. Good boy. Now with with no treats or nothing. Tripper, boat. Yes! Good, 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 good boat. Good boat. I gotta stop saying yes. Good boat. Good boat. Yes will come in as a release later on. Over here, come. Yes! Ah, oh, snap. Good boat. Good come. Good boy, Tripper. Yes, good boy, good boy, good boy. Good boy. Tripper, boat. Yeah! Good boat, place. Good. Well, today's the big day. We're taking Tripper out on his first boat ride. It's been uh, a couple weeks probably since I started training him in the boat here. Maybe about a week. So we'll see. We'll go get him in the water. It's a chilly day. We'll see what happens. Ready to go. We got Tripper in the crate next to me. I keep him in the crate in the car for the first little bit until he's a little bit older. But we're going to drive about 40 minutes to a smaller lake. It's pretty windy today. Um, this lake that I'm driving to has an opportunity for splake. Let's go. We'll get back to you when we're at the lake. Tripper's a good boy laying down. You want a little snack for the road, big guy? A little snacky poo for the road? Have a little, little chicken breast. Have a little chicken breast. There you have it. He's my good boy. Oh, sorry. Oh, no. There, oh, no. there you go. beaver pond I went to that lake a splake lake and it's still iced up but there's a beaver pond pretty close to here and it's open so we're gonna use that I don't imagine there's splake in it I'll bring my fishing rod just in case even to, to teach him about fishing but I, I don't have high hopes but it's okay at least there's open water come we're not near the water yet silly I've got a little mat for him because I want him to stay in one spot. So this mat goes up in the front. Boat. Good. Place. Down. Good dog. So to keep him, keep his energy and, and focus and everything right there, I'm going to give him a marrow bone. And that marrow bone, down. Tripper, down. Good dog. That marrow bone stays there. Hopefully he stays there. Now we gotta get this whole spiel in the water, this whole rigmarole in the water. Oh, you know what? I need to put his long leash on him first in case he decides he wants to jump out. I need to be able to get him. I don't have a collar for him because he's too, uh, way too small still. And that collar will only be good for one use. Or sorry, a uh, uh, life jacket will only be good for one use. Are you growling at me? Don't growl at me, bro. All right. So I've got his long lead there. In case he falls in, I can grab him. I'm sure he'll sink like a brick. But uh, there we go. First time on the water trip. Oh, here we have it. 
Wish me luck. He has no idea, and that's the whole point, right? I try and grab this camera. A little sketchy. That's what I call a sticky situation. Don't growl at me, bro. Don't growl at me. Tripper. Tripper. Oh my gosh. He's gonna be a... Uh... <laughs> oh my goodness. We're in the boat. So the canoe is a success so far. The growling at me isn't the greatest thing in the world. I can work on that, but uh, but we're in the boat, and he doesn't care at all. So chalking this one up to success. I'm gonna paddle around this little tiny pond. There's no fish. Look how shallow it is. Even if there were fish in here, it looks pretty bassy because of all the weeds and stuff, and they're not in season right now. But uh, yeah, we'll do a little paddle. So Tripper was the runt, or if not the runt, very close to it. Um, so he might have had to compete against his litter mates for food and stuff like that. It could have something to do with the growling. Um, he doesn't ever act on the growling, which is good, but uh, yeah, it kind of worries me with the kids. So I got to work on that big time. But this was the project that I wanted originally. I wanted him to know stay. I wanted him to know place. I wanted him to know boat. I wanted him to know if he jumps out of the canoe, that's not a good look. <laughs> but he's now, right now, you can hear, I'm splashing the water. The canoe's moving every which way. It's not balanced, it's, it's tippy. You know what I mean? We're tipping all over the place. And he does not care. He's not even batting an eye or looking up. Obviously, it's because of his bone, but this is the first trip and that's what I wanted. I wanted him to have no, like, just to be indifferent about the boat, not to be excited about it and not to be scared of it. In all honesty, he probably is excited about the boat because he gets treats in it and stuff, but <laughs> I'm learning. I'm still trying to learn. He's doing all right. As long as he doesn't knock my camera into the water or jump into the water. Tripper down. Good down. I don't know about throwing a fishing line in right now. It is kind of hectic and windy, but we shall see here how he, how he fares in a minute. I don't want to keep him in the boat too long. I don't want to stress him out. I don't want to um, burn his energy too much in the boat. You're a good boy. Tripper, place. 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 place good boy all right well let's go over to this uh let's get over to that corner over there that little uh point and we'll throw in a fishing we'll throw in a fishing line we'll throw in a lure put our line in the water we'll get our line wet i can i can talk 
right, we got the old fishing rod. It is an old one too. Let's hope for a pike. <laughs> Every single time. Good dog. Good dog. Good dog. See how quick he learned? He got bopped with the with the baler three times. Lays down. Don't want nothing to do with it. Good boy. You are a good boy, Trip. So what's good to see is him start sticking his head over the side and enjoying the ride and taking in the smells and the view and just the whole experience as opposed to him just constantly worrying about where his treats are coming from or gnawing on that bone like in the case of yesterday. But today, oops, sorry, knocking all over the place. Today's a different story. He's pretty aware. Not right now, right now he's searching for morsels. <laughs> there he goes. That's a good boy. That's a good dog tripper. Yeah, bud, you don't got nothing to worry about, eh? Good down. Good. Good boy. He's a very smart dog and I need to keep and I need I need to be a very fair owner. I need to keep very consistent with him. I can't really explain to you how happy this makes me. I'm uh I'm going to be canoe tripping with my dog and that's something that I've always wanted to do. I just when I first got scout it what I wasn't I didn't know anything about canoe tripping. I, I wasn't um, proficient in my wilderness <laughs> experiences and I didn't know how to train him properly for the canoe but this is uh, this is going really well he's standing right now looking over the gunnel hey good boy you're a good dog tripper you're a good dog but yeah very happy very happy I want to give a huge thank you and shout out to Robert Cabral he, uh, he's been helping me a lot with this and Again, I'll link them in the description. I really want you guys to go check them out. Well, Tripper, I think this is it for the video. Hey, good boy. Hope you guys like this video. I will be doing a little small series about training Tripper for to training Tripper to be a wilderness dog, training a dog for a life in the wild. You know, what? you need to get back in your place. Place. What are you growling at, homie? There's nothing there. There's absolutely nothing there, big guy. I appreciate you wanting to protect me. But really, what you growling at, boy? Let's see if he jumps out when we're near the shore. I hope not. That's, that's my car? That's my car? We drove here in that? There's a camera there too, man. You, you should be used to that by now. And a rock. He's all tripped out now. Fine in the boat, not getting out. Don't get out of the boat. Coming out of the boat. Come on. Good dog. Yeah, let's get rid of this. You did a good job. You did a good job, big guy. Oh, the big boat. You did a good job, Tipper. Yes, good job in the boat. Good job in the boat. Oh, all right. I did say in the boat. 